we have been busy with every two hour round the clock tube feedings for two tiny beautiful boys since yesterday afternoon. For boys but these two tiniest chihuahuas were too weak to suckle and were not gaining weight. Their mom was starting to push them away to care for the two stronger boys. These two baby boys are responding to the tube feeds and gaining some weight, peeing and pooping with assistance. These tiny creamy boys are four days old. At seven days old, sadly puppy two had too many hurdles to try and overcome, prematurity, very low birth weight, much less developed than his also tiny brother, and a respiratory infection. While he gained weight well at first with tube feedings, he started declining yesterday and then he started having a hard time breathing and passed away today. Another puppy he's doing well and we are hopeful that he will continue to overcome the odds. He's so tiny, his little head was the size of our thumb. Sleeping little creamy boy. I wonder if he is dreaming. Already he has such an expressive little face. Those ear twitches especially. Our creamy boy loves being wrapped like a burrito. He is still congested but is gaining strength. Day 10, puppy 4 has doubled his birth weight and is really gaining in strength. He has been trying to climb his way out of the laundry basket. So excited about his progress. His name is Stuart. Happy Halloween from Stuart the Banana Baby. Day 14, Stuart opened one eye today. Several of Stuart's feedings over the last week. He needs help with head control and body position, and is still using a miracle nipple which is the easiest flow nipple. I think part of that is his prematurity and part his continued runny nose and congestion. But he has progressed to feeds every three to four hours and is gaining weight at a steady pace. We love how he uses his paws while nursing and provide a surrogate fluffy puppy dog mama during his feedings. What a difference three weeks can make. Stuart is giving us kisses and getting lots of snuggles. He is doing very well with his growth and overall development. However, he does not appear to have any vision at this point. This may change as he was a premature pup. Day 25, Stuart is wobbly walking and learning to play. Since he still doesn't seem to have any vision we are using a toy that has crinkle sounds to interest him. We are also using touch and voice to guide him and help him navigate. Stuart loves his new bed. The size and softness are just perfect. Thank you so much for the donation of the wonderful bed and new toys like this sensory ball Sharon Lee and at Thornton Rhonda. Especially with his low slash no vision his senses of touch, smell and sound are so important to engage. Stuart is teething. His little teeth are coming in. Also he finally hit one pound at four and a half weeks old. He loves his new musical mouse and watch to the end to see who is keeping a watchful eye on him.
Playtime with five-week-old Stuart. Visually impaired puppy exploring his world through textures, smells, and sounds. If at first you don't succeed, keep trying. Stuart did. Stuart shows off his play bow, tail wags, and desire to play with our Dax. Stuart has been visually impaired but now as he turns 6 weeks old is showing definite improvement with his vision. Stuart at 7 weeks is finally eating gruel. He is down to two bottles a day of puppy formula. I love his cute eating noises. You have to see the before and after session. Dax is such a patient boy and good teacher. Remember to thank the teachers in your life who quietly set a great example to follow. Stuart was initially jealous when his brother joined us. Is this singing or just talking? Well it is Stuart style for sure whatever you want to call it. A whole new world to explore. Stuart and George's first moments of discovery outside in our backyard. Stuart being so tiny, just under two and a half pounds, and born prematurely. We wanted to wait until he had gotten two vaccines and it was warmer day before the big introduction to the outdoors. I thought he might be nervous. But instead he was eager to smell and try to taste everything. Stuart has become the little boy who can hold his own in play. He scampers and runs so fast, dives under, jumps over, and fully enjoys romping until his brother jumps on him. Forgetting any offense quickly, a minute later he copies his brother trying to chew, dig or skeek a toy. Hoping they are worn out now so we can enjoy our last night of sofa snuggles with them. months old, so happy to share that Stuart went home today with his new mama. We will miss him but know that he is in fantastic hands.